Hi, my name is Topaz, and today, me and Ender are throwing Roman back into the torture chamber for part two of guessing the names of every single Five Nights at Freddy's character, Security Breach Edition. If you haven't seen part one, go watch that one first. Or not, I don't care. That video just blew up, and I am so thankful for all the positive attention it got, so you guys definitely deserve this part too. So without any further ado, grab your popcorn, grab your candy, grab your granny, hold her tight. She doesn't have much time left. Let her know you love her. And enjoy. Are y'all ready for the tier list? Are y'all ready to get this show on the road? Momentarily. Let me turn off my tunes, because I don't want background music. Can I have my tunes on? Yes. Okay. No, you're not allowed to have music. This is a sad moment. Yeah, I haven't Can had I have music a window in a while. on my so like I'm recording my view as well. On my screen, should I have a window that's just like playing porn? Uh, uh, um That sounds like a good idea to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let me pull it real quick. <laughs> as long as it's playing through your headphones, I I don't care. No, I'm putting it on a part of my screen. <laughs> oh, no. Yep, don't worry about it. How do I download this? <laughs> um, <laughs> what are you downloading? <laughs> what, what, what is this you're downloading? Shh, don't, shh, 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 shh. don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I won't. Okay, two minutes. Two minutes, right. okay. Two minutes. Um, got two minutes to kill. Mm-hmm. Um, what is your favorite bean? I like a Boston baked bean. Oh, I never had those. No, they're pretty good. They're pretty sweet. Oh. Yeah, I always like them a little crunchy, too. Oh, a little crunchy. <clears throat> those are some good beans right there. I like good beans. Oh, yeah? What's your favorite? Uh, um, you, you know, the, 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 the ones. Have you ever made bean before? Oh, have you ever made a bean? Yeah, I I don't. Uh, oh, I've, I've never even <laughs> touched a bean, let alone made one. <laughs> have you ever eaten one? <laughs> what, what are you asking me? <laughs> Who do you think I am, Jeff Bezos? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it seemed like a pretty simple question to me. <laughs> I don't think you know who you're talking to. Dang, maybe I don't. <laughs> I'm so white, I haven't- I don't even know what a bean is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure how that works out. The whiteys don't jive with beans, okay. Some good knowledge right here. <laughs> what do you jive with? Um... I, I jive with uh, samba, um, a little bit of tango. Um, so you're not into, into beans, but you're into samba. And, yeah, and salsa. <laughs> and tango, and, but no beans. No beans. <laughs> you're very cultural outside of those beans. I'm, I'm so cultural. <laughs> okay, let's start. Once. Let's start. Okay. All right. Um, so this is the newest FNAF game. This is like an open world kind of, well, not like open world, can open building? It's, it's open my balls. <laughs> open my balls. <laughs> yeah. So this is the protagonist. What is his name? Uh, ben Tennyson. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, what? Where would you put Ben Tennyson? He's a whiny little bastard and he goes into C or D for me. He gets I, killed too easily. I would put him in D. Also, I still don't understand why he was there in the first place. He just kind of existed. He kind of just existed in Ruin also, just for no reason. Who's this guy? Uh, Iron Fredsworth. <laughs> All right, Iron Fredsworth is going straight Iron to S. Iron Fredsworth goes immediately to S. Immediately to He's S. He's a superstar. I'm sorry, superstar. <laughs> Have you heard of this hit game called Among Us? <laughs> Gregory, yeah. I'm sorry. I messed up the cobblestone generator. <laughs> <laughs> uh, automatic S, easily. <laughs> All right, who's this person? Um, oh, I can't see that well. Let me full screen this one. Oh, Gotta get the close-up view. That is a guitar. Uh, uh, <laughs> chicken guitar, I don't know. <laughs> chicken guitar. You got it! Chicken guitar! <laughs> yeah. Woo! Woo! Chicken guitar, I would say like B tier. I would say B or C, but then you have to factor in a very, very important fact. 
Uh huh. Chicken guitar eats garbage. A tier. Immediate A. <laughs> All right. Who is this radical looking guy? Girl. Uh. Golf. Uh, <laughs> it's Nelly Leroy. <laughs> All right. Nelly. Automatic S. Like I, I'm gonna be honest. I'd put it above um an iron fist clad <laughs> Finkel here, because in Ruin, Nelly is the sweetest person. Also, they're the hottest animatronic. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the internet agrees with me. But yeah, it's just like she says in the main game. She's the best. Mm. Everybody loves me. <laughs> Also, when she literally dashes at you blind through fire, it kind of, I mean, she puts in the effort. She needs to be S. Honestly, Nelly is the only one that's, like, actually terrifying. Dude, I think of Sister Location. What? <laughs> <laughs> security Breach? <laughs> damn. I think of two things. How damn long I spent in the generator play place mm -hmm. and the fear of the ball pit. And then also that fire room. Yeah. That fire room was... Who's this guy? Daniel. <laughs> that was fast. <laughs> I feel like you were really cooking on that one. He was planning. I was just thinking about it as you guys were talking. Daniel! Yeah! Daniel! Where, all right, where would you put Daniel? He makes a really strong appearance, but his final boss fight was so glitched that it was like so hard to beat sometimes. Yeah. But also his death is epic. B for Daniel. He would go higher, especially because he has anger issues, but... He's just so glitchy compared to the other ones that- <laughs> Also, I feel like you see him less than you should. Ain't no way you just said B for Baniel. <laughs> I said B for Baniel, yeah. <laughs> or I said B for Daniel, which is even worse. That's what I heard. <laughs> <laughs> who, who is this guy? This guy is like really, really tiny, if that helps. He's, just, he's very small. Oh, um, it's like one of like those monkeys. What are they yeah. called? Um, <laughs> I don't. I wasn't born in the 1800s. I don't know what they're called. <laughs> the secure, yeah, the security guard from Toy Story 3. That's what he's called. <laughs> um, I'll call him Orangutan 2. <laughs> the sequel. I like it. <laughs> I want to see Orangutan 1. <laughs> okay. Where, that where is do you... not Orangutan. <laughs> <laughs> where do you put Orangutan 2? Horrifying the first time you see him. After that, he is not easy to die to. He is very just underwhelming after the first appearance. He is the size of a hand. Mm -hmm. I could kick him. I'd say probably like D or E even. Are I'd you... say D, but what? above the child because he can kill the child and he's that small. The child is very weak. <laughs> Honestly, pretty impressive. <laughs> so the next two are technically the same character, but not really. It's kind of strange. I don't even. I don't know the exact lore, but yeah. Who They're is... the same body, but they have two different personalities. Yeah. So who's who's this guy? Alchemy. Oh, the you... idea of alchemy in robot form. <laughs> uh huh. All right, where would you put alchemy? Oh, alchemy is great. Straight to A at the very least. Put it. I'm bordering on S, but yeah, I say A for alchemy. Yeah, A for alchemy. All right, who's this dude? Uh, that's Bubs. <laughs> Whoa. Hey there, Bub. <laughs> Alright, where, where do you put Bob? I do not understand Bubs sometimes. Like, can he fly? I don't see any wires. <laughs> but how? He's metal. The physics like, are know, very strange and unexplained and kind of stupid, honestly. Obviously, he was honestly. meant to be in the air at some point because he has that swimming animation. Yeah, like, he's- if I mean, look, I think they should have explained it with strings. Yeah. But, like, they don't. It just makes it seem like he can fly as a hunk of metal. Yeah, like, he does like, fly. That's, like, all he huh? ever does is just fly. Yeah, through walls to touch my toes. He doesn't make any sense. It becomes nighttime, like, seven times throughout one night. Um, he's, he's a cool idea, but he's too broken to work. I'd say E, maybe yeah. even lower. He's yeah. just so broken. Who is this guy? Um, that looks like a Tina to me. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna commandeer this one. I'm putting Tina in S tier. Wait a minute. Whoa. I need some explaining, sir. The only explaining you need. The comedy stylings of Staff Bot. <laughs> and then it's just them standing there on stage. Okay, well then you know what? I would say we duplicate that picture and head to, because the comedy standings of, of of Tina need to go to S rank. But 
<laughs> all of the rest of them, their only purpose is to cry for mommy. Yeah. They see you go, wee you, wee you, and then out of thin air, a giant eight foot tall robot appears because physics are broken. Also, there's way, 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 way too many of them. And every single, okay, I don't know if this is still a thing. I haven't played it lately, but at least when the game was older, their frame rate is different than every other object in the game. Like when they freak out their frame rate, it's like 24 compared to the 60 FPS all around them or whatever it is. Like they're like in, like they're like choppy slow motion. Comedy stylings of Tina, absolute S rank. Every other Tina can suck my fuck. Putting that in G. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Who is this guy? Uh, that's Techno. <laughs> wow. Where would you like to put Techno? I honestly don't have many strong feelings about Techno. I'll let you take the lead. Uh, I don't have any strong feelings for anything in Security Breach. <laughs> I have very strong feelings for one very important moment in Security Breach. Zap, why though? <laughs> <laughs> that is what I care about in Security Breach. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll put this guy in C tier. Like, I do not, I'm not offended. Middle ground, we do not care about him. Yeah, I, I just don't care. <laughs> Oh my god, it's this guy again. It's your favorite one. He has a Mexican restaurant. Yeah, good old Vicente. <laughs> hey, Vicente. S rank, S rank, S rank, S rank. He is now a proud entrepreneur. <laughs> he did it! I'm so he, proud of him. He made it up in the world. He's I'm a so proud. He's a multi-million dollar franchise owner. Oh damn. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that is that a person that is a person <laughs> that is a white woman <laughs> <laughs> you haven't seen the movie have you there's a movie uh just came out oh, it's okay. so good no, i haven't seen it it Never really it. people get mad because the animatronics possessed by kids act like kids you want to know my only problem with the movie is her being there i did i don't think it makes sense in any universe even if they're doing a new timeline i just eh whatever but yes back to white woman how do you feel about her what's her name how do i feel about her yeah or what's her name <laughs> um, how about Both we... if you feel like it <laughs> uh i got some disdain for her <laughs> same <laughs> any uh any particular reason why uh it feels like something that i should be mad about <laughs> Honestly, valid. <laughs> <laughs> oh shoot, you don't have her other form in here, do you? Other form? <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about it. It's a confusing game. <laughs> we already did her other form in the last tier list. That was the only we did? That's yeah. so confusing. That is so confusing. <laughs> what did he call it? Do you remember? That might give it away. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, yeah, name the word. My entire life. Uh, I'll name call her Carol. Carol. <laughs> Carol. Yeah, that Carol. is a fitting name. All right, where would you like to put Carol? Dude, I mean, okay, she's ass in some ways, but also she make she made the best meme of Security Breach. White woman jump scare. <laughs> and then, dude, the live action version of her did the same shit with that POV <laughs> shot that's been going around. Yeah, it's literally the same meme. <laughs> um. So honestly, it's a wild card. Since we ranked her other form last time, are we just ranking this? Are we just ranking white woman? Yeah, because honestly, I forgot the ranking for for for, her F for female. <laughs> All right. I have a lot of problems with the story of Security Breach. Mm -hmm. Why is the child there? Why is the white woman the only one guarding the entire place? Why does she hate this kid so much? And what, how are we meant to just accept that it ties to the other sh I don't- No. G F for you. You got an F on your being not a white woman paper. <laughs> Next. Alright. Who's this guy? No elaboration. So, as opposed to the other- the, the, this one, this guy no, is absolutely know. giant. Alright. It is so... I do not understand how they got him in there. Like, you know how as a kid you wonder, how did they get this car in this mall? That's how I feel about him and the Pizzaplex. He's huge. DJ Robotnik. <laughs> Alright. I mean, he got the DJ part spot on. <laughs> I would put DJ Robotnik in like A tier. The sheer scale pushes him to A. It doesn't have yeah. to make sense for him. Yeah. Okay. Uh, actually, I'm going to send you the model for this one because I can't even see that. I can't even see that. What is it? There you go. It's what the, the hell? <laughs> meat thing. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> All right. Is that what you're calling it? Meat thing? Yeah. First thing in my mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where would you like to put meat thing? I can't tell what it is. <laughs> it's the blob. The blob. Am I? Wait, am I high? I think you Shit. are high. This was, was this wasn't ruin, right? Yeah, this is base game. Then what? The, hold on a minute. Maybe it's just because the image, but I'm having a strong. You gotta send him this one too. <laughs> hold on. Uh, why? Why don't I remember this thing? Oh, right. I saw this thing maybe once. <laughs> I don't even know, man. I didn't. I. I haven't. I didn't see it enough to have a good ranking. It only appeared like once honestly and it doesn't really make any sense why. to me the entire does any part of this game make sense to no, anybody absolutely not like i feel like everything was going confusing a little bit but smoothly until they released this game mm -hmm. <laughs> and then they just gave up on trying to make it coherent yeah. <laughs> like i thought it was really cool what they were doing with the secure with the uh, sister location characters mm -hmm. them kind of merging into different like versions of themselves in pizza plex so doing this with it, G. I don't. It's they made it show up like once to the point where I don't even remember if I saw it in the game. I think I've seen one fan art of it. I never. I don't know if I even came across it in, because I didn't do every ending. That's how obscure this bitch is. Who is this guy? It's like Tony's brother. <laughs> Just a little skinnier. <laughs> oh no, Frankie. Tony's brother! <laughs> Frankie. <laughs> Alright. No, I think we should just stick with Tony's brother. That's a great title. <laughs> oh my god, we have Tony, Frank, Frankie. <laughs> oh my god, this makes sense because we have Tony, right? And then we have Frank, which is like the digital embodiment of Tony. And then we have Frankie here, which is like. Uh, which is like the physical form of Tony mixed with the digital form of Frank Frankie. Oh my god. It makes it makes perfect sense and it sounds like Tony and Frank mixed together Oh my god There is no there is no um, There is no way you planned this Whatever you need to tell yourself, buddy <laughs> I I'm just gonna uh-huh through that entire thing <laughs> do I do I sound like a madman rambling? I don't remember who Frank Absolutely was. Absolutely you do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. The only reason you remember the names we gave the last one is because you edited the video for however long. Yeah, you sound like a madman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be sitting in the psych ward just oh, Tony, Frank, Frankie, Tony, Freddy Finkel. <laughs> I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. I saw Freddy Finkel in my dreams. I saw the ostentatious Fontaine. <laughs> where, where would you put Frankie? I've seen the ending maybe twice. And so the only thing that I think of when I think of Frankie. Is that he used to be a huge, he maybe still is, in the speedrunning community it was a huge obstacle to get past that part because it would keep crashing because the game was so broken. And honestly, story-wise, it makes no sense. Just, it I just mean, doesn't. has he ever made sense? I mean, yeah. I mean, not Frankie, but like Tony made sense. I'd Frank, I would, uh, uh, I don't really know how okay. Tony makes sense. I'm, I mean, let's, let's run this back. A guy kills a bunch of kids. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Uh -huh. Their spirits haunt him. Uh -huh. Fine. Trap him in an animatron animatronic suit for, what, 40 years? And he's just, like, fine with it and still alive? I Everything mean, past game three, he did not make sense. No, I mean, like, he's dead, but he's, like, possessing the suit. But the suit just, like, happens to have his corpse in it, because that's how he died. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> 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 you say he doesn't make sense now. How does he make sense in the VR game? He doesn't. He makes even less sense. Oh, I'm gonna put pieces of myself in this so when someone plays it, it puts me together and I'm like alive again? What? Throw him down at the bottom. I don't know if you want him above or below, white woman. I'm putting him like bottom of G. I don't care. And the fact that somehow she ends up as his like follower. Yeah. It was fun to theorize on the games in Element School when there was like five or six of them out because you could actually make up your own story that made sense. Now, it's just like, oh, okay, so he, um, what? <laughs> and that's the entirety of it now. 
There's a reason MatPat's been driven crazy. Because they stopped trying to make sense halfway through. From here on, I don't know what's going on because I still haven't done Ruin. I might not because Security Breach kind of disappointed me. <laughs> yeah, kind of disappointed everyone, but it's fine. Okay, who is this? Um, Carmella. Oh, Carmella. Honestly, Carmella is way, 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 way better than the child in base game Security Breach. I'd, I'd put Carmella like A or B. <laughs> okay. I'm doing the Macarena on my screen, don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. Are you gonna have any input? Or is it just is it, is it just gonna be me? I've never seen any of these characters in my life. Right. What in the name of <laughs> Oh god. That Who's... looks like a mix of two characters. Who is, is he that? a mix of two characters? No. Uh that's Cyber Funkle. <laughs> Funkle, I <sighs> Uh, I, I don't even have any words for Funkle. It, it it just doesn't make any sense. I mean, like, it's it's the it's, electric Rizbo does what he wants. He doesn't have to make sense. He makes the law. It's more of just a plot device in Ruin, honestly. And like, so every single character in Security Breach, you mean? Literally, <laughs> it's it's just a plot device. It's it's going it's going below White Woman. I don't care. Where's the other Cyber Funkle gonna go? Oh, these two yeah. are these two aren't characters. I don't know how to delete images. Oh no, put them next to him. Oh, all right. There we go. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> He's, <just clicking. laughs> He's so much taller. <laughs> <laughs> Tall boy. It's Cyber Funkle and <laughs> and his big brother. <laughs> and his what, what's his big brother's name? Electric Rizbo. There's more Wizbo. That's where my name comes in. Yay! We both win. <laughs> Yay. Okay. <laughs> who is that? I think I know who that is. Um, that's Alchemy Two. <laughs> Alchemy Two. All right. Alchemy Two. Um, honestly, didn't really have much personality. If I'm gonna be honest. Bro, what? They took the character with like the most personality in the entire game and turned him into nothing? Kinda, yeah. Clean up, clean up, clean up! <laughs> I feel like it would be really insulting to put Alchemy 2 below a literal wet floor sign. <laughs> so, <laughs> so um, I'll just put him above. I like how everything in D and below is literally <laughs> than a wet floor sign. <laughs> That's how phoned in this entire game was. <laughs> Who is that? Frankenstein's monster. <laughs> yeah, that could be the second one. Uh, uh German. <laughs> <laughs> Expound. <laughs> Elaborate. I don't know, I was looking at it and then German came to mind. <laughs> All right, Germany. Um, Germany was no, really... not Germany. He's just one German. German. Just a single German, single German man. Honestly, really, really, really hyped, but like, not really a lot of payoff. Honestly, it was just you got to see his dead body on the floor. It was like a secret Crazy. for like flashing all the flashing all the wet floor signs. I love flashing signs. <laughs> um. <laughs> I'd, I'd put him below wet floor sign, I'm sorry. I mean, a dead body is less useful than a wet floor sign. But you keep him in C, though? If he's below wet floor sign, is he really C tier? Okay, I'd put him top of D. Okay, Germans in D put his big brother, Germany, next to him. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes, he's a tall boy! Oh my god. Where did the rest of them go? <laughs> Into the wet floor sign. <laughs> no! <laughs> they got consumed by the wet. <laughs> wow, Ooh, that actually doesn't sound too bad. <laughs> oh, you forgot a character from the base game. Uh, the weeping angel type people things. You know what a weeping angel is, right? Uh, okay. Uh, hold on. Let me just let me just pull up an image. Uh, okay. Who's that guy? Uh, I don't know. It looks like a Jacob. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Worth it. Jacob is the but only yeah, I think scary literally... thing. No, no, no. No, he is not. Jacob Look is at the, the final member of our tier list. Oh. Oh my. He's the second scariest thing in the game. Because oh my god, they actually made those things terrifying. <laughs> yes. Aside from our final character here, um, Jacob is the only scary thing 
in the entire game. And it's supposed to be a horror game. FNAF is a horror franchise. And nothing about Security Breach is scary. I'd put him, honestly, pretty high. I'd put him in the A's. Yeah. I'd... I would put him in S, but it's, you know, it's a taken idea. It's literally, I think they're called Endo B, quote unquote, Angel Endos, because they're based on the Weeping Angels. Yeah. And it's fine to be based on something, but... You gain a rank if you're original. Here's our final boss character. What's this guy? He looks so scary. Galetto. Gahoo. <laughs> <laughs> you heard me? <laughs> you know what? You're right. It looks like I could kick him once in the chest and he'd turn to dust. How is he a boss? <laughs> I don't know. Actually, I could sneeze and this man would blow away. <laughs> so that's what he looks like when you get like the true ending. Crazy. But this is what he looks like when you just go through the game as normal. He's wearing just like a random <laughs> suit. <laughs> Bro, he smelt it. <laughs> he looks like he was on the edge of Chernobyl. <laughs> Yeah, this version of him was on the edge of the blast, and then the final version of him was in the blast. <laughs> he hit the button. Like, seriously, he looks like he's wet, and the other one looks like he can turn to dust at any moment. Why does this guy look moist? I hate I, I that. I think they both look dry to me. I don't know, this one looks... I, I think it's because he's, like, saggy. He looks soggy because he's saggy. I know, I think he just looks like that. He's a soggy boy. <laughs> no, it looks like he's got like dry skin. Huh. I think he needs well, some my, yeah. my name for him is Chernobyl Victim 12189. <laughs> uh I'll call him Murphy. <laughs> <laughs> Does look like a Murphy. I really underwhelming honestly, but not not too underwhelming. It's just he looks underwhelming. He looks like he hasn't finished for his wife yeah. in eight years. <laughs> oh. Okay. It's it just like, but the kind of disappointing thing, like you had to have read the books in order to even understand what was going on, and that's kind of the crappy thing. And yeah, I mean, yeah, and I don't really like that. Tie into the books. But you don't need to have them to know what's yeah. going on. This Especially one, Pizzeria Simulator. Yeah, this one's just not even explained. I mean, it is kind of the plot of of Ruin. It's kind of why... It, it explains why Gregory is talking to you. Because it's not actually Gregory. It's actually this. What? <laughs> yeah, it's it's it makes no sense. And it's just... Uh, I, I just don't like it. I just don't like it. I'd put it above little man there okay our final one let me uh let me send you a good image of this final one okay. this is uh this is our special boy this is the scariest thing in the game this is the scariest thing, the thing in any horror game i have ever played i'm going to tell this to you honestly like i'm not even joking at this point i have never been more jump scared in any game i have ever played in with this guy first time i played doki doki literature club i did it blind i fell off of a chair live hmm. D this scared me more you i almost fell like, off your chair or did you fall i went into time <laughs> I, I was in bed i like oh you went off the bed <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. it's the scariest thing in this game it's the scariest thing i've ever seen in a horror game so this is the final one this is the best character in the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise. Man, I really hyping this character up. Yeah. I love this I say hat. In the entire franchise? I mean, all of the foxies? Yeah. Wow. This is the I'd perfect say he's specimen. My, I, say he's, I would say he's in my top five or top ten. Yeah. That far? Crazy. This guy is the perfect specimen. I'm going to put you in a specimen. Ugh. Don't make that noise while I'm drinking. <laughs> <laughs> um... Let me think. This is a lot of pressure. Uh, yeah, especially how, you, how much you hyped up this character here. Is I, it a girl or a boy? Um, or is it a thing? It is the it. it. It is. It just is. It just is. Because that hat makes me think like, oh, it's like an old lady, like an old librarian or something. Uh -huh. I'm trying to think of a librarian name. Or, or an eccentric adventurer in the jungle. <laughs> eh, no. You can see the little, the little white hair right there? <laughs> the <Hair>? entire head. <laughs> no, the thing below the hat. I do not. Oh, I think that's. That oh, hair? yeah. That's a crease in its metal, but you do you. A metal crease. 
A metal crease. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll call this. Uh, I'll call this thing joint. <laughs> For a second, I thought you were going to call it Metal Creepies. <laughs> I was thinking about it. <laughs> Alright. Joint, I think we all know where Joint is going. <laughs> Do you agree No, with no, this? wait, 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 wait. Hit the cog next to the S tier button. Add a row above. Get black. Brotato chip. This guy goes and in a rotato chip. There goes Joint. <laughs> and there it is. There's our Yay, tier I'm list. I'm really happy with this. I like Germany. <laughs> German and his big brother Germany. Yeah. <laughs> his really big brother. Okay. I'm honestly debating. Ah, I don't know. Okay. What did we call Bernie boy? Frankie. That's what it was. I don't do this often. I am debating putting him in James Corden tier. Oh. Oh lord. I don't know. It makes less than no sense, man. I don't know. I don't know if he's that bad. I... Okay. Separating him from... I'd say he's bad enough. I'd I'd say he is bad enough. This is the worst color. Yeah. Uh, light yellow, like a color that's like not even yellow enough to be. Now I feel comfortable about this. But wow, now I feel comfortable about this tier list. That is, this is the most beautiful tier list we've ever made. And that's the video. Thank you all so, so much again for all the positive attention the last video got. And thank you all so much for watching. I hope our terrible security breach takes didn't offend anybody. I feel like we're going to have some especially civil conversations in the comments. I, I can sense it. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. And, uh, oh, and by the way. Happy Wheels episode 104, Jacksepticeye, three days ago. Okay.